<laughs> a few almonds. Yeah, I know, know exactly. <laughs> Ready? I am backstage at Pamela Rowland here with Mateen from Laura Mercier. Thanks so much for Hi. talking with me. My pleasure, thank you. So tell me a little bit about your inspiration for this season's look. Well, Pamela's uh, inspiration was Art Nouveau, mm -hmm. and she wanted to uh, kind of bring those colors, the, the juxtaposition of colors and shapes back. And uh, you will see it in her clothes. Sometimes you see like a graphic wave of black coming into white and, and a lot of shimmers and a lot of beautiful sparkles. So I kind of wanted to kind of work off of that. And some of the inspiration I had personally to, for the look was, um, was very, very nude, everything very soft colors because the clothes are really mm -hmm. soft with just one punch of graphic detail. Um, so for this, we picked up the eyes. Oh, this was one of my favorite stunning. look of, uh, yes. that Laura Mercier had done herself before. And, oh, um, wow. and I, I've always gone back to references that right. she has done. Um, so I, I kind of picked that up and, and discussed it with, um, with Pamela and she loved the look. Mm -hmm. So that's what we're doing. It's a very graphic eyes. It's not very 60s. The, the, yeah. the, the, the wing is out mm -hmm. and also the bottom is very straight line right. uh, across. And it extends on both sides. Mm -hmm. A little shimmer on the cheeks with pink, a little shimmer on the eye, and a glossy lips. So it's a very fresh and modern mm -hmm. look. It could be toned down for every day, or it could be used like that if you're just going out to a club or a cocktail exactly. party or something. So it's uh, it's very versatile, and anyone can use it. It's beautiful on the girls. Well, and this is something that also that you could really use on any skin tone, absolutely, and, and really any any face shape as Abs well. Absolutely, it's very easy. When it's, it's so elegant, it's like you cannot go wrong you with a nice liner. With that. No. Yeah. no. So tell me, I just love the liner so much. So tell me kind of how you how you apply the liner. Well, the best way to do it is I'm using a bigger brush. If okay. you like to see the brush, it's yes. like this. So it's not like a teeny tiny brush. Oh, okay, it's yeah, pretty fabulous. Big. Yeah. So I, I wet the uh, cake liner. It's the, the black ebony liner. Of course, mm -hmm. this is you cannot get any color out of it without <laughs> water. Um, let me make a paste. So you're just making so you just basically little paste, make yeah. a little paste, and then you know if you're shy of black, you can always use brown or gray uh, exactly. um, or plum to make it yours. Mm -hmm. uh, so. If you see the the brush yeah. is fairly thick, so you basically fearlessly Ooh, draw, and then you can go back and perfect the line. Right. So. So just don't be afraid of making don't it be afraid. thick no, and No, because that's what you want to do. Because you can you can go back and and really make it exactly the way you want uh, by cleaning it up with a concealer. Exactly. And the same thing on the bottom. You just kind of you know brush it. I hate it without the knife. <laughs> So it's kind of like... So the bottom, you're keeping like a little bit straighter. Straighter and, and less heavy. And then you just kind of, they, they don't meet. Right. And both ends, it kind of stays open. So... And I feel like that's what makes it so modern. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's not it's not your 50s or, exactly, or 60s. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So it's it's kind of got that little inspiration to it, but it's so modern and fresh. It's modern at the same time. It has that classic feel to it. You yes. Know? Exactly. You can always have that classic. Looking for work, you can just avoid this part. Right. And just yeah. use the top part. And part. then you know, after work, you go run in the bathroom Absolutely. and yeah. add that, add more and, and and you're, you're, you're ready great. to go. Out. Exactly. So then, tell me a little bit just about the skin. What the you did skin on skin. The skin I'm keeping the skin glowy, but not shiny. Okay. Um, the only shine that you really see is is just where the eye spark and the cheeks sparkle. Okay. So for the eyes and cheeks, we're using um, this eyeshadow and a little bit of uh, nude shimmery color. So as you can see, it kind of twinkles. Yes. Actually, it's called Twinkle Star. <laughs> and if you look at it, it's almost like nothing. So you yeah, see the skin through it, like and then you just see a little princessy oh, kind of glitter. And that will look good on any skin tone. Anybody could use so this, absolutely. This just, I'm using it on, on very dark girls, I'm using it on very pale girls. Yeah, and some so this is just a great color just to have. Oh, it's, it's a must for have, everything. you have to have it, yeah. of course. I mean, I'm like, I want this color. Like, yeah, <laughs> it's <you>. very easy. <laughs> <laughs> After the show, you can come and get yes, one. Yes, I'll come and get one <laughs> Absolutely. <from you. laughs> so just for the everyday woman on the go, what is the best advice that you could give her when it comes to makeup? Keep it simple. Okay. Don't try to do everything at once. Uh, pick a lip or an eye mm -hmm. and just perfect that and have secret camouflage to do your skin perfectly and you're good to go. Can't That's all you need. It. Absolutely. Me neither. <laughs> yeah, it's fabulous. Thank you so much and congratulations. The look Thank you. Stunning. So, Glad you like. So excited to see you with the clothes. Thank you so much. Thank you. Have a good Thank one. you so much. Bye. I love you.